I am allergic to stupid, and I break out in sarcasm. Now, on that note, today I will be teaching you how to understand and detect sarcasm. Now, you have to understand that there are two types of sarcasm. One, the humorous type, where it's used to simply make a joke or lighten the mood. And then the second type, the insult sarcasm, where it's used to deliberately hurt your feelings. Now, a lot of people use sarcasm every day. I conducted a survey with 102 responses and 98% of people said yes. Now, the 2% answering the survey probably just answered the survey sarcastically. Now, when I asked them if they use sarcasm every day, 77.5% of people said they use sarcasm every day. That 22.5% of people probably don't encounter stupid people throughout the day, which I don't understand how because they're everywhere. Why do we use sarcasm? Some people use sarcasm because their family uses it, it's a heritage thing. Some people use sarcasm because they're smarter. And some people use sarcasm because they're, uh, they use it to cover up their feelings. Now, w people who use sar sarcasm because of their family, 74, 74 people said their mom uses it, and 72 people said their dad uses it. Now, here's what I think it's funny. 35 said their grandpa used it, and 44 said their grandma uses it. I think that is a life goal right there. If you're at a family event, and one of your uh, relatives says some, something dumb, and you're able to respond to sarcasm like, like that, that is a goal. Now, some people use sarcasm because they're actually smarter. Scientists have conducted surveys, and they have found that when the brain is introduced to sarcasm, it actually has to work harder to understand if the statement was a true statement or if it was simply just sarcasm. Now, some people use sarcasm to cover up their feelings. Out of those 102 people, 69.6% .6 of people said they have used sarcasm to cover up their feelings. Now, why do they use sarcasm to cover up their feelings? When I asked, I simply got answer, they don't want to deal with their feelings right there, or it's easier to use sarcasm to, it's easier to use sarcasm than to deal with their feelings. Now, to understand sarcasm, body language is a key component. If they have their arms crossed and are staring like right at you, that is, they probably use the insult sarcasm on you. But if they look down, uh, kind of frantic and even sometimes walk away after they use sarcasm. They probably use it to cover up their feelings and they don't want to deal with it right there. Now, if they use sarcasm and they just simply carry on the conversation, then they probably just use the humor of sarcasm. Now, with all this information I presented to you today, you should be able to understand and detect sarcasm. And if you don't, well, bless your heart. Thank you.